All right, hey guys. I was having um, breakfast with my wife and I recorded this run as well as a, a few other runs, but I wanted to go ahead and talk about the findings that I've had post nerf to Hydra, or should I say the, the buff to Hydra, however you want to call it. Now, I was always confident that I would still do a pretty good amount of damage with my Nightmare team. And you're going to find out that, yeah, I, I'm still doing a pretty, pretty good amount of damage. But then again, I'm not the majority. I'm part of the, uh, I guess, like, what, 10%? Five plus years and pay to win. I don't know what I would categorize myself as, but I'm definitely uh, not a Kraken. I was never close to Kraken, but I have spent some thousands. So um, let's go ahead and see the run. Again, this is Nightmare. This is the same exact team. I haven't changed anything. I haven't buffed anybody. Uh, on the left, we have Inquisitor Shamayel, obviously to deal with the head of... Let me bring this up. We have Inquisitor Sham on the left to deal with the head of uh, Fear, whatever that head is called. I keep forgetting. And anytime a Fear is placed, we don't have to worry about um, Fear proccing. The Acrisias, their damage are based, have always been based off of enemy max HP. So you see 299, 243. Well, that is the same exact damage, amount of damage that they were doing with decreased defense on that they've been doing pre-nerf. Now, they never said, Polarium never said they were going to nerf enemy max HP champions, but I think it's worth noting that if you have enemy max HP champions, you might want to consider bringing them out, especially with the Trunda nerf. If um, Well, here's the thing. If you were a Trunda abuser, you're probably not watching this. You probably already have other options. Um, but in the event you have somebody like Newt and you're not incorporating them into your Hydra team, or if you have an Acrisia, and for some reason you're not using Acrisia in your Hydra teams, um, I would gently remind you that maybe it's something to consider because they're still doing uh, a heavenly amount of damage here. Now you see that the Hydra heads now have an HP pool and that kind of sucks. I hate seeing that. I'm so used to seeing the purple bars. It's so weird and off-putting for me to see. Uh, not, not a big deal, but we're still doing a lot of damage. We have almost 600,000 on this head. I saw, what was that, like 500,000 on this head? Six, 600,000 on this head from Acrisia. Another 600, 600 from Acrisia here. So obviously the Acrisias are going to be doing damage. They're going to be doing the most. We have Supreme Gaelic in here. He is in a cursed set. So if you're wondering where that curse, where that hex is coming from, it's coming from Gaelic, who also places the block buffs, HP burns. He's just an awesome champion um, all over. I want to put Krisk in a hex set also. I feel like that would really bump up my damage, but then I'd be sacrificing some speed, I think, because my cursed gear isn't that good. And I don't think I could achieve the amount of res that I need. So we'll see. I, I, I need to farm more cursed gear to make him, um, to, to keep him within the same realm of where he is in terms of stat power while still maintaining that cursed energy, um, cursed gear output. And then of course we have Duchess here who is phenomenal. He, she just makes it so that we receive less damage due to her passive as well as keeping it reliable um, in terms of keeping us alive. Keeping us reliably alive is <laughs> what I should say. So yeah, let's go ahead and move a little bit forward. You can see the, ki uh, the kind of damage that they're already doing. Let's move right here. So you can see 115 turns in, we're at 206,000. Staying strong, let's move a little forward. Pushing 300K. Now prior to this, uh, I forgot what my, my best record was, but it, it, it went up, it went up. So here we are approaching the turn limit, staying strong, no issues whatsoever. And I'm thinking when I get Marius on this account, I'll probably switch out one of the Acrisias because I got Marius on my main account and I put him in my nightmare team and I replaced him. I, play, I replaced Newt with Marius and uh, it's it's pretty exciting. I, I can't wait to share that with you guys. Now, let's move a little bit forward. All right, here. Okay, so 929 turns in, approaching the turn limit. We're at 400,000 now. Oh, sorry, 400 million. What am I saying? 400,000. 
400 million. And I don't think I've ever done this before. This definitely broke my record. I think the highest score I've ever gotten was like 360, 390, something like that. Six or a nine, one of those. But it's weird. And the reason I bring that up is because I don't think I should have been able to break. And again, this is full auto. That, that I'm not clicking anything, as you can see. My, my mouse is staying right here on the right side. And uh, if, if you want, I can upload the entire thing, but I don't think you guys want to sit there and watch the entire run uh, with no sound or anything. I could put music if you want, but this isn't a Deadwood, Deadwood Jedi video. Um, but this is a full auto run. You can see I'm not clicking anything. My mouse stays here the entire time. But it's weird, right? Because they said that Hydra was going to get harder, but for some reason, I broke my record. It doesn't really making, it's not, it's not really making any sense to me that I should break my personal best. Acrisia did a million twice over here on this head. And this um, devoured head, the devouring head, now has a larger pool for us to try to whittle down to release our champion that's getting digested. But it's it's nothing uh, nothing to worry about. Some of you might say like, of course you're going to be doing this kind of damage because you're X, Y, and Z and you have these champions, but I I'm not saying this to like flex or anything. I'm just giving an update of where, where I'm at and giving my first look at the post nerf Hydra, as well as sharing my curiosity as to why I'm doing more damage now. It just it just kind of doesn't making, it's not making any sense. And I've been running this team for, I don't know, a, a long time already for years now. So uh, I find it puzzling is what I'm getting at. But okay, so let's go ahead and move a little bit forward. Let me see if I can just kind of scoot there. All right, so it gets devoured and it ends here. Uh, 400 and let me pause right here. 433.57 million. We reached the turn limit. I feel like it would have gone even further if the turn limit wasn't reduced, but I honestly don't care. I don't mind. I'm happy with this because with this, you can still get 1.2 billion. And I think you only need like 200 or 300 million to reach 1.2 billion. But both Acrisias, 162 here, 182 here. This Acrisia is in Merciless. This Acrisia is in Savage. Chris and Duchess providing a lot of support, as well as Inquisitor and Supreme Gaelic with the cursed and um, block debuffs or block buffs up. So yeah, it's crazy that I was able to do more damage than I did before. And you can even see here. So here you see 433.57. We broke my record here, 433.57. 